There are really five benefits that I can think of offhand that will come from repealing the income tax. First of all, you will, of course, no longer have to pay that enormous burden to Washington. And if you're a typical middle class family, we're talking about $10,000 a year or more. $10,000. What would you do with that money if you no longer had to send it to Washington? Would you put your children in a private school or a religious school or homeschool them so that you can have exactly the kind of education you want for your children? without having to beg the state for a voucher, without having to plead with the Board of Education to please teach my children what I think they ought to learn. Would you start your own business? Would you support your church or your favorite cause or charity in a way you've never been able to do before? What would you do with that money? It's your money, you earned it. It's amazing to me that here you are, you get up every day and you go to work and you work eight or 10 or 12 hours a day and yet the politicians believe that they have first call on that money, that they should take what they want and let you have whatever is left over. You know, George Bush is the candidate of smaller government, he told us in one of the debates. And because he's the candidate of smaller government, he said that he believes that the government should never take more than one third of your income. <laughs> I can see you swooning already in, in, in <laughs> ecstasy. But really, this is the way they think. This is their money. And they decide how much of it you should be allowed to keep. Well, I believe you should keep it all. You earned it. And you should decide how much you're going to send to Washington. And if you decide that you just can't afford to send any this week, well, that's your business. <laughs> The second benefit is that everybody you deal with will get this enormous cut in taxes as well. If you are in business for yourself, all of your customers will get a similar increase in take-home pay and have more money to spend. If you work for somebody else, your employer's customers will have more money to spend with your employer, and your employer will have more money to distribute among the employees. The third benefit is that everybody in the country will have more money to work with because it will no longer be going to Washington to be squandered on so many worthless programs. And because everybody in the country will have more money to spend, we're talking about a trillion dollars a year, which will be left in the hands of the people who actually earn the money rather than squandered by the politicians. A trillion dollars a year. That's enough to buy a job for everybody who can work and charity for everybody who can't work. The fourth benefit is that your life will be your own at last. No longer can they pry into your bank account. No longer can they call you into an IRS office and make you justify everything you put on your 1040 form. No longer can they treat you as guilty until you prove your innocence. No longer will you have to justify every deduction and prove that every exem exemption is uh, legitimate. No longer can they intimidate you. No longer can they pry into your life. No longer can they control your life. Your life will be your own. And the fifth benefit, which may be the most important of all, is that no longer will the politicians have the money to mess up our lives.